we're here today is to share the focus we as a team have in investing in educational resources for kids. It is critically important for me personally, as well as a business owner, that we are reinvesting in our communities as a whole, but especially as it relates to education. For the Child's First Book encourages them to think, learn, and be creative. And I can tell you, I remember the first book that I had when I was a child. It was Mr. Pine's Mixed Up Sign. I think about that one. I can still remember that. I still remember my grandmother giving me the book and sitting down and reading the book to me. And then ultimately, soon I wanted to learn how to read the book myself. I think I memorized it first after being read it a number of times. Today and all this week, we've had First Book staff and local volunteers helping to distribute almost a half a million books donated by Random House and Disney, which are being shipped to programs and schools across the country. 155,000 of those books are staying right here in St. Louis, in the St. Louis area, to support educators in our schools. As a member of First Book Network and across our 2,000 programs throughout the country, more than 3,500 individuals are a part of the First Book Network and rely on First Book resources to meet their mission. Over the last year alone, Parents as Teachers programs acquired a half million books from her First Book for their work with low-income families in their local communities. Our children, when you imagine Let's say for a half a million books, if only 10%, 10% of those books changes the lives of children, 50,000 children, develop a lifelong learning of appreciation for reading, are inspired to do something that changes the world for all of us. This makes the difference. And that's what's so encouraging and exciting for me about this situation.